So hi everyone, you might have heard of OpenAI's deep research tool which is gaining quite some traction on the internet because it is able to generate some detailed reports on any topics. It is scraping through the entire internet and then getting you a detailed report on it. Similarly, even Google has released deep research tool but the difficult part about these tools is that they are paid services. So basically Google's Gemini deep research is free for certain iterations but not free completely and same goes for open AI deep research tool as well. But now we have got a completely locally running deep researcher tool that is Olama deep researcher that has been trending on github for some time and as you can see this is a UI which internally uses the open source local models that has been pulled using Olama be it DeepSeek R1 or be it Llama 3.2 whatever you wish to do and then creates a similar report but that too for free you can set this up in your local system and let's see first of all see an example and then we will jump on to how to install this so just provide it a research topic for example indian cricket 2025 and then we'll press submit and here you can see that the entire pipeline has started for you generate query on on the right hand side you can see the results coming for each of the section and you can see that it is going through these web searches getting done summarizing resources and this is quite intuitive as well reflect on the summary that has been generated and then multiple settings also that you can do again going for a web search summarize resources this is quite detailed as you can see and you can understand everything the ui is quite sleek also and then multiple options present here what's new contact sales invitations change theme etc as you can see this is as deep research you might be knowing that it takes some time because it is going through a number of websites on the internet so this takes some time but this is running completely locally using olama and you don't need to pay a single penny so once we see one of the results then we will be going to the github repo and how to use it in your windows or any other system i'm using it on windows and i have a decent enough gpu so i think it's working without any lags but at times it might be lagging for you if you don't have enough resources so you need to use a smaller llm in that case i will be telling you how you can play around with the llm also so as you can see our results are ready mostly i'm assuming you can go to it prettify or json format also add to data set multiple things are there this is a thread you can ex uh, start up a new thread also and here is the output that has come so here you can see that this is the values that i extracted the summary entire report and what are the resources being used this is json output and it looks quite sleek apart from that if you look into the options view raw multiple things are present manage assistant you can play around here as well you can change your local llm i'm using llama 3.2 Search API is duck, duck, go and Olama base URL is this. Recursion limits are added. Add tags also. So there are multiple configurations that you can do. You can add a new assistant also and that gets activated in this locally running deep researcher. So now let's jump onto the GitHub repo and let's try to understand its different features as well. So as you can see, this is released by Langchain, uh, one of the topics that I've written a book on. And now they have come up with Olama deep researcher and this is how it op operates. Topic search the query web search happens create and update the summary reflection happens whether the summary is correct or not final summary with resources and how to get started i think first of all you need to if i go through the windows download i think i'm assuming most of my users are windows so you first need to do an olama pull deep seek r18b that means you're pulling out the llm for olama whatever model you wish to use then you need to git clone this particular repo that i'm going through then go inside this particular repo and then pip install the requirements and for initiating the ui you just need to do langraph dev that's it and then you should be able to see the similar ui and now you can create long detailed reports and can use paid services like deep research from openai or google gemini for free in your local system thank you so much i hope you try out olama deep researcher